It's time to get in the game. What's up everybody, it's Adam for Rando Reviews and this week's review is brought to you by the saying you don't want to miss it because how many times in life have you missed something that you weren't supposed to miss? I think you made it through it just okay. So what I have for you right here are these brand new Onikuma gaming headphones that uh, I got off Amazon for about $28, $29. And what you see is exactly how they came in the mail. I didn't get a uh, box, it was just a plastic bag with these Onikuma headsets. So you might think that's cheap, that's bad, but actually it's pretty good because I don't have to go through all of the presentation of the product to actually get to it, so it saves on cost, which is a good thing. So these Onikuma headsets, they got kind of the camo look, the, uh, you know, to me it seems a little dated with this look, it seems like it's very 2008 Call of Duty-ish, but what's cool about these things, it's got the LED lights on the side that light up via USB input, but they look pretty cool when you have them on. They fit well, they feel amazing. This little cloth ear cups feel really good around your ears. They're over the ears, so they're not gonna be pushing up on your head. So they feel really good. And besides the camo look, I really like the LED lights that are on the sides and on the microphone. So if you wanna use the LED lights on your headset, you have to use the USB that's connected to it. But then it also has, for your computer connection, you have these three 0.5 millimeter jacks, one for your headphones and one for your microphone. But if you're using it for your Xbox, your PS4, things like that, you just gotta plug this into your controller. Now the problem with that is that to plug that into your controller and this into your PS4, or Xbox to get the LED lights to work is probably impossible. So for only $28 on Amazon, you're probably wondering, do they work good? They got some style, but do they sound good? So I used these headsets playing Apex Legends on my Xbox One and my PC, and it sounded great on both of them. The sound quality on these headphones are pretty good. When I played Apex Legends on my PC and Xbox One, I got to hear all the callouts, got to hear the enemy sneaking up on me and killing me immediately, but it sounded really good. I was impressed at how well these sounded compared to my $80, $90 Turtle Beach headsets. The only problem I really had with these headsets is when you plug it into your Xbox One controller, if you move it at all, it gives you that staticky sound, which is not the best. Of course, I never had the problem on PC because once you plug it into your computer, you never touch that. But when you're using these with a controller, you might nudge it a little bit and it might give you that staticky sound that you're not wanting to hear. And a pro slash con of this headset is how big the cord is. It's probably six feet or so. And so when you have that much cord, it's good so you can move around the room. However, if you have a six foot cord and you got it connected to your controller, you got this big piece of cord that's just kind of dangling there. The microphone sounds real good. It's not gonna be like podcast quality, but no one wants a gaming headset for $28 that has uh, audio quality that sounds like you're recording it on a condenser mic. But these sound great. Your, your teammates are gonna hear you just fine. The quality of these headphones is really good. You can size them for big heads like mine or small heads like a child. Uh, the quality of the plastic feels really nice. It doesn't feel cheap like it's going to break. The, the plastic actually feels pretty heavy duty. As you can see, I can just bend it as much as I want. I don't feel like it's gonna break. The, the ear cups are so soft. They feel so good on your head. I mean, I'm just impressed for $28 that you can get a pair of headphones for your gaming, uh, for Switch, PC, Xbox, PS4, all those systems for only $28 on Amazon that sound just as good as the Turtle Beach, uh, HyperX's, Logitech's, things like that. It's kind of hard to go wrong with these Onikuma $28 Amazon gaming headset. So if you're in the market for a brand new pair of gaming headsets that will not break the bank at only $28, I'll put the link below where you can buy these on Amazon. These Onikuma headsets feel great. They look cool. They sound great. Uh, just a little bit of issue with the plugging it into your, your port on your controller that gives a little bit of static, but once you kind of realize just don't touch it while you're playing, it's not that big of a deal. And for PC users, you're not gonna have that problem whatsoever. So that's it for this rando review. I hope you liked it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for more rando reviews, like, comment, share, all those things. And we'll see you next time right here on Rando Reviews.